It is a moment of soccer for 19 underaged children trafficked from Benue State to Lagos as the arrest of some traffickers by the anti-human trafficking units of the 4 CID Alagmon in Lagos State reinstates their liberty. Working in collaboration with the UNIS Spring of Life Foundation and Break the Silence Initiative, both non-governmental organizations, the Benue State Government receives the victims. The angel sent a message to Women Affair and she responded to the plight and uh, were asked to convey the children to Benue State. Here we have 19 uh, persons that were trafficked from uh, Benue State to Lagos. We intimate them, so many trainings took place for them, how to detect such kind of people and that is why the Shogo people were able to detect yesterday and we have realized that we have three people who suspects are now in the custody of the police. The need to provide children with all social safety nets for growth and issues of rights violations and justice is again brought to the front burner. Our message as Unispring of Life Foundation to parents is that uh, despite the difficulties, they should take proper charge of their children and they should make an effort to see to it that their children are well taken care of and that they should monitor their children so that they are not uh, sold into trafficking. And just as the repatriation was ongoing, three more traffickers were arrested in Oshunga local government by the chairman. The National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons, on its part, assures the victims of justice while working with the police. As an active, there are other procedures that will take over after this, and we hope to work in, in collaboration with the Commissioner, Honorable Commissioner, other stakeholders that are here to see that these children get justice. Benue State is gradually becoming a hub for trafficking in persons and underaged children, particularly with the deplorable state at the IDP camps where victims of harassment attacks have been taking solace since 2018, and the near absence of parents taking proper care of their children.